My name is Tony Silva and I am in South America. I came here because I wanted to further study reproduction in parrots. In the wild, parrots nest at the end of the dry season. And there's a reason for this. Plants, as the drought starts and continues, congregate all the proteins, all of the key elements for survival in their seeds. Why? Because if the drought is prolonged, the seeds can always germinate and carry on the survival of the species. The parrots nest at this time because they know that food is at its richest, highest in protein, highest in fat, highest in components that are necessary for growth and development. They don't nest when it's raining as many think because one, chicks would get wet once they fledge and their chances of survival diminish or the nest could get wet and they could die in a fungus-ridden, moist nest. In aviculture, we need to understand that we need to scale up from a period of a Spartan diet where food elements are low in fat, low in protein, not a lot of moisture, to a boost in fat, a boost in protein, and uh, a lot of moisture. And we provide the moisture in the form of vegetables because parrots have not evolved to process sweet fruits. They don't eat them in the wild. So if we can do this, we can induce breeding. It is very important to follow a scale up, a transition from a Spartan diet to a very rich diet very quickly because here in the dry forest where this military macaw was born, uh, the plants start building, building, and then it explodes the amount of nutrients they put in their seeds. We do that, we will achieve success.